Hey guys, it's Dry here, and welcome back to What Remains of Edith Finch. So, when we last left off this episode, the last episode, my apologies, we had just finished Calvin's story, which is the twin brother of Sam. So, we're going to keep venturing forth into the great unknown and figure out more about my family's past. As soon as I fix the audio. Sorry about this. There we go. That's a bit better. Mom said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. So I'm assuming Grandpa Sam died. No. Grandpa Sam went to war and never came back into the room. So he might have died in the war. We don't know. We know Calvin died. Mm. Swinging too far. Is this the way I'm supposed to be going? Yep. I love this game so much. The whole, like, housing and everything. This is like a dream house of mine. It's like having housing with secret tunnels and passages and all this stuff. And it's just really cool. It reminds you of something. A house of, like, Beauty and the Beast type era. Like, if Beauty and the Beast had a house in real life, it would be this. Except I hate this bathroom, but other than the bathroom. Hmm. Built 1937. So, we kind of... You know the bips and the bobs and the doodahs? Oh wait, but did I go too far out? Possibly. That's okay. So I did have to actually restart the game and kind of fast forward a bit to where we were. So you guys probably won't notice, but it might be things have don't pop up or like whatever. But um, yeah, because I actually have recorded a bit of this and then they you got corrupted and all the fun doodles. So I thought I would just quickly go through. So some things might be different. I don't know if I've missed stuff, and I'm pretty sure from yeah, I had to go over here. Sorry, apologies. Like like something like this, the hungry caterpillar, right? And then you make it smaller until it's all gone, and you know turns into a butterfly. Something like that is really beautiful. Now I've thought about getting a tattoo. The butterfly is something I want to get. A butterfly and a heart with chains wrapped around it. They're my ideas for attaching the passages the were a pretty tight fit. They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. Smaller bellies? You're not that fat though. So it's interesting to say smaller bellies. So this must be Growing up, Barbara's I always room. thought of Barbara as a child star. Yeah. Barbara Streisand. I never thought about how hard it must have been for her afterwards. Barbara Streisand. It definitely must have been, because she was in, what, one film? And then that was really it, from what I've seen. I could be wrong. But she looks very beautiful. The All dreadful the stories, people stories people about Barbara's of death. Bob. I'm surprised Edie saved this one. Interesting. Let's have a look. Ooh, patches. Oh, Jack. I need with some another yeah. ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. I'm calling it the surprise ending of Barbara Finch. As a child star, Ooh, story Barbara time is old Jack. Screen. Now at sixteen, she was all washed up. I can't even scream that loudly. 
But in a lucky break, she'd been asked to perform her signature scream at a local convention for monster movie fans. It was just a boost her career needed. So I'm guessing like BC Con would be like something like Avcon Comic Con. <laughs> Getting better. Oh. I think you just need the right motivation. Is this a boyfriend? Ed's current boyfriend, Rick, was about it's to always the boyfriend. When... <laughs> now that that was, was good. Dream. It was Bob's <laughs> Same, Rick. Sing. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency Same. room. So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother Walter. Yeah, I think that's fine. Comeback was cancelled. Take him, take him with you. Okay, I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing okay. terror. What if I tried? A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing. What if I tried kicking tonight. you? Police are urging residents to. That came from the basement. You're right. Also, that I came from the basement. Mat. Let's Why go investigate. Because my dad likes making puzzles and secret passages. There's a key hidden in the music box. The secret okay. is to keep so you have to keep winding it, I assume. And winding until finally the key pops out. Thanks, babe. I'll be back in a sec. Oh, I hate the word babe. Twenty minutes later, Rick hadn't returned. So Bob uh -oh. went to look for him. Right on cue. She mean right on cue. She reached for the music box. And what do you mean right on cue? Like this is all set up? But the house was silent. Rick? She Grab the crush. Scratch and imagine the worst. I'm gonna go for the blood, even though I know that's my dad's handprint. I'm still gonna follow it. The gang's leader is the infamous Hookman Killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. Can we get rid of this thing? No. Nope. That thing is ugly. Do some boxing. The old fridge rattled and grew stale. Why would you? Okay, whatever. Oh dear! Oh. Really? Rick? Barb. Why, relax. Rick? I was just trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, I'm not. I was just trying to Rick. scare you. I'm furious. I'm then furious. I'm furious. All I'm Damn well you should be. That you're hurt and confused and you're. She threw him mm. out. Getting furious now? Barb, why would you keep a you crutch? My other crutch? And she was still holding it when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. Hours later. Why? Barbara! Walter, what's going on up there? Ah! Yeah, you forgot about your brother. Okay, I'm coming up. But if this is a trick, you're dead, Walter. If you heard your brother just be like, ah, oh, you'd be like, okay, I'm coming up then. Like, no, you think something's going on. So it's Halloween in 1960. Walter? 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 It's interesting that they got rid of everything in Walter's room. But not anyone else. Like, everyone else's room was sealed up in the same, but Walter's was the only one that they changed. Vanished, but his bedside radio was still on. Orca's Island police described the man as six feet tall with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged to lock all doors this and windows did. and notify the police of any suspicious activity. Barbara turned, um, saw the hook man, and was speechless. He was twice. Scream, girl, scream. 
Good, finally. He couldn't get enough of Barbara. Okay, Barbara. There's gotta be another way out of here. Come on. Let's go. She played her part beautifully. What part? Inflicted. What do you mean by her part? Boom! Bye, boy. I like this like comic style. It's really cool. But she sensed the story might not be over yet. Yeah, cause there's there's no blood. Plus, I would be running down the stairs. He's gone. Why? Honestly, if that's Rick, I'm gonna just slap him right across the face. It was coming from inside the house. Oh dear is another response you normally give. Really? And she hey, saw guys? what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. She what? was going to be famous. And with her final breath. Barbara Finch gave the performance of her life. So they killed I her? Myself, but I hear Barbara was magnificent. So all of her fans and monsters she killed her. For stardom, but hey, the crutch is in the corner. So did her fans. Of course, the police blamed it all on poor Rick, who disappeared the same night. Yeah. And oh, so Walter, he got killed. Hiding under Aww. his bed the whole time. He took it all pretty hard. Poor Walter. But that's another story. As for Barbara, you coming back, old Jack? The music box is all they ever found of her. Her ear. Why her ear? Now that's what I call. Real eerie tale. Uh, also, why would you cut off someone's right ear? That's a weird detail. So she could listen to the music? Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered. As absurd as that comic was, maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Yeah, she got remembered. How weird. So she got killed by her own fans. Well, so this room seems very kiddish for I her 16 I guess now I know why mom doesn't like me playing with the music box. Yeah, because it had your... A family member's ear in it. Whenever people ask me about my family, the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. Makes sense. She would have been the one most well known. It's just interesting, this entire house. Like, I don't know, every little detail to me is fascinating. I wonder if this is an actual song. Like, is, does anyone know this song or is it just a random song made up? Down, down, down we go. 
Wait, we'll go only I know. Because the rest of my family is dead. Mom said the basement so, was off limits. Unless I wanted another So this is grandfather's. Shop. Why'd you need one in the first place? I saw Edie sneak down to the basement once. Carrying packages. I thought maybe she was Why is she carrying presents? packages? Aww. That's a bit childish of you, and a bit cute. It turned out she was hiding a lot more than that. What is going on? I remember asking well, Mom I once cannot... about where Walter had gone. What? She said We're in an underground he got as far away as basement? But not too far away. If there's a pattern in all these stories, I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. So Walter lived Goodbye. underground. I can't believe I've been down Ooh, here for that 30 voice. Years. Thirty years. On that first day after the shaking started, I didn't think I'd survive. So she died in nineteen sixty. So but he waited eight days, years until coming down. That's what kept me sane. I'm assuming. Having a schedule, leaving for today. And not for tomorrow. I always expected to be dead. There's a lot of pages to have. But if you wait long enough, you get used to anything. Except blue tack doesn't exist apparently. I like how they're playing all the different like the other side of the door, music uh, to feel um Almost you know friendly. like decades. So the, mem uh, the monster would be the memories I'm assuming? That's what he's afraid of? And then one day, everything just... stopped. So I'm assuming they're different spices. Whatever hey, 2005! It was gone. I would be four, because it's in May. Waiting. Or maybe I just got tired of being afraid. It's getting more and more freckles. Which is interesting, because usually you can get a lot of freckles been a week now, from being in the sun. The longest in 30 years. Ooh. I'm done I don't waiting. Look very good. I have to leave. Well, I still can. Okay, I'm leaving. Where am I going, though? More secret hatches? How deep is this bloody house? So how many books does this house have? What? I know it's out there. This must somewhere. have cost an insane amount. Whatever killed Barbara. So he doesn't know and what Mom. killed Barbara. And Calvin. And Mom? So you think there's a precise Maybe thing this, that's going to fall? mistake. But I need to stop living the same day. Even if it kills me. Yeah, that's a fair point. Changing up your schedule can really help a lot. That's Whatever's what I'm going to try and there, do. I want you to know I'm ready for it. I'm going to appreciate You're ready to leave. Especially the food. <laughs> yeah, because you've had peaches for like, what, 30 years? Or a month. Or a single week. I'd be happy with one more day. That is beautiful. I can already imagine the sun in my face. So I'm assuming you got hit by a train? Possibly. Walter died when I was six. I can't believe my mom never told me he was down here. 
So you'd be I'm sure 18, my mom not was trying 17. To is that a wedding ring? Also, am I pregnant or am I fat? Am I pregnant with food or am I pregnant with a human? Like, I don't know. Am, am I pregnant? Hmm. Maybe she was afraid of him, like Walter. Curious. But if she never told me about an uncle under the house... What else did she tell you what about? Else she was hiding. Because that's a big thing to I hide. I want to make the this? same mistakes she made. Hold on. Oh, so I'm shooting like, all the cans and stuff over the years. I'm trying to bury something. Why do they all have to make tiny holes? Now that there's only one of us left, or maybe two. Maybe two. I think she's pregnant. Because she said one of us, which would be the main character. Or maybe two. I thought it the was little time baby knows tell me. For myself. And found out what happened to everyone else. Wait, so you said you're 17, even right, though I think you're 18. Might be the problem. Because I'm 17. No, actually, no, you could be 17. You're 17 and pregnant and possibly married. Maybe we believe so much to take in. in a family curse. We made it real. Walter. 1952 to 2005. Pay my respects. Hmm. I don't know if I should be like hearing this. Well, we still are, though. Maybe it'd be better if all this just died with me. But it's not going to. But I thought but you should not. know about your family. Yes, tell me about the family's history. And the history you're a part of. Hmm. Though to be honest, I feel as lost as you probably do right now. Yes, yeah, so she's writing this to her future I child. Think the people in these stories believed them, for what that's worth. It's a nice place to have a house. Sorry. <laughs> From like, oh, I think she's pregnant too. This is a nice place to have a house. No, I can't see. Well, look at the view. Again, okay, sorry. Brains jumping around. I want to know if she's pregnant. That history of imagination and stubbornness and madness. Any of it seems. You know possible. your home. Hmm. Questions. Too many questions about this character. I'm gonna try this way first. No, okay. I think we've so been I guess we keep walking. Death for so long, we've just gotten used to it. You'd find it the what normal. What kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? Guess that's the depressing part, huh? When you have a family curse. It's embarrassing. You'll start for me dying to admit one. This, but one. The pet cemetery may be more uncomfortable than the human one. Three of the gerbils are mine. We got two had been my fault. So we got Lucy, Daisy, Charlie, Coco, Zoe, Tucker. We got Derpy, Derpia, Burpy, Chirpy, Furpy, Lurpy, and Zerpy. <laughs> It's such childish names, I love it. There's one for a frog, we don't know the name of. We got Bob, Shadow, Oliver, Christopher, and 
something I can't read. Sib I want to say Sib Sibbeth, maybe? Oh, and Bailey. Is there any other ones I missed? Not yet. Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. Because she knew what was happening. So we have Molly Finch. So you would be Calvin. You wanted to fly. Sev, yep. Yeah. Edie. I love that, that's beautiful. So she is the one that died most recently, 2010. Walter Finch. Barber. You can tell that. Alright. I'm sure it was fun that it had been Edie's idea. My mom was always Probably. trying to move on. But for Edie, the past never went away. It's because the house, the old house sunk or something. And she so could see it poking like, oh, in the water. Oh, we'll a new tide. house. Oh, is it that one over there? Like, right there? Hmm. Maybe. So this is Odin's kind of, like, monument thing. Hmm. Can we focus? Nope, I went way too far. Oops. Edie said she dreamed about the old house every night. Oh. It looks beautiful even though it's in water. Also, this water texture though? Job well done. Hmm. Sorry, I was just captivated by the beautifulness Edie's that is. is always easier for me to understand Edie's. first side of the, the family get, or like the just... more I can see where my mom was coming from her side in general so these are three more graves her dad so your Gregory strict, wasn't Sam enough to save her brothers she was just trying to do better I guess Sometimes the text doesn't come up, so you have to like, walk up to it. She so you're the painter, you're Milton. Just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Louis and Sanjay. Sanjay's a cool name. Sanjay! There's so many things I wish I could ask my mom now. Part of me thinks you this is what she wanted all to along. Dive. For me to come back someday. Find so you can find out about your own past. I get that. I would do that. I'd leave a scavenger hunt and be like, future child of mine, let's just say Rosalina, this is your past. Go find it. Go explore. Go venture but forth back into the now, great unknown. If she told me there was going to be so much climbing, I never would have come when I was. Are you gonna say you're pregnant? It's pregnant. Oh, got it. So 22 weeks pregnant. That's what six months. Possibly. I don't know. What is it? 30 weeks when you're pregnant. But yeah, like I had, the only reason I gave away is because of the belly, the little belly, the belly, the little belly. The, the, the belly. And it looks like a wedding ring, but like that could be wrong. Also, who's, who, who's the significant other? Just, just a little question, not, not to be rude. I just want to know who the significant I never other is. That's Sam, okay with you. I think he and my mom had a lot in common. Hmm. Army. Let's pull you across. They were both pretty intense. Sam spent his life shooting. Yeah, okay, let's look around. Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. So, photographer. So, he was definitely a photographer. He looks like he has army Instead medals. of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out hey, of his way to Hey, I have that exact same umbrella. It. Yeah, so I'm assuming he joined the army as well. 
It's hard to see when it's nighttime. But living in a treehouse would be pretty cool. Seems comfortable and, like, homey. I guess it's what you make it. Yeah, so he was... Wanna say na army? Navy? Army. Army, because... Yeah. Army! <laughs> we don't... Yeah, I don't know. This is American. I don't really understand too much. I'm just assuming it was a military... Oh, that's a cool photo. Yeah, that's a very Texan military photo. Don, I promise you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, oh. sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Don. Shooting is strongly encouraged. Okay, so, yes. Oh, hi. Perfect. There you are. It's gonna rain the whole weekend, isn't it? Probably. Please just take and the damn picture. Click. Hey, language. Hey, language. <laughs> what am I taking a picture of? Oh, there you are. Never forget this oh weekend, God, Dad. That's the spirit. Okay, got it. You were literally me. You were legit me, constantly pictures, reading. Okay? Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. Hmm. I love this. It's cool. My You're little right, photography. Dad. It's starting to clear up. It's still freezing, though. What can I take photos of? I'm assuming I can just take photos of whatever I want. Is it gonna show me a sun? Nope. What is this? I don't know what I'm supposed to be taking photos of, but like, I like it. Let's just look around for a second. Oh, it's a bird. Hi. Shh. Aw. Aw, you flew away. That's a nice camera though for how old it's supposed to be. Should not have drunk all that coffee. Uh, what? Why? Why should you should not have English? Why should you not have drunk it all that coffee? English. Dad. Hmm. Hold still while I take a picture. Hey. <laughs> That's a keeper. Oop. A little more gas in the tank, I guess. I'm just saying, hmm. I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff, if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Will you? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. <laughs> yeah. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in Yeah, relax. Years. Where are you? Don't see you. Puppy, where are you? Last time I was with my brother Calvin. Man, that was a great trip. Do you miss Calvin? Your grandpa's Fen taught us how to fish. How to build a fire. Don, don't you think you could find something more interesting to photograph? No. We found an old logging trail. There were deer everywhere. I bet if I could remember where that trail was, we'd spot a buck for you in no time. <laughs> uh huh. Give me a minute to check the map. Well, 
What's this? I like how you can use that like, camera and stuff. Oh, way too zoomed in. Let's see. So, I'm not taking a photo of your dad, just of the map. You're hogging the map. Maybe. One in. You don't need to waste any more film on me, kiddo. Well, I want to. I want to remember you. What was it? What am I doing? Let's have a look around. It's definitely beautiful out here. Like scenery-wise, it's pretty beautiful. It's a cool rock. <laughs> Let's see what else is there. A double click a pan a room. What's behind me? I have no idea what I'm supposed to be taking photos of. But let's see if we can take a photo of the food, yo. Don't know what you want me to do, Dad. Bit conflicted. I'm just gonna keep taking photos of Dad. He's like, yeah, 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 focus, who cares? No words, okay? What does the sign say? Or am I just permanently blind? Never mind. Dad, what am I supposed to do? Like, I'm enjoying the view and all that, but like, what am I doing? I don't know. I feel like it has to do with that deer looking. Let's see if I can go like out of focus so it looks like a deer. Anything, something, maybe? Question mark? Canoe or kayak? I don't really know the difference between the two. I'm lost. Let's look up, maybe? Yes.